In order to create inspection reports, the standalone software must have information from the project document to pull from. Manually inserting this information, while valid and sometimes necessary, can become time-consuming and tedious when working with many drawings that have large quantities of characteristics. Instead, I'd like to take some time to show you alternative methods by using the extraction tools inside inspection on this drawing of a disc plate. These tools can be found within the Document tab of the ribbon, under the Extract and OCR Extraction sections. I'll start with OCR Extraction to explain how extraction works. OCR stands for Optical Character Recognition and is the underlying program that allows SOLIDWORKS inspection to recognize and extract information. This lets you select from one of several types of drawing characteristics that you'd like to identify and then click and drag the tool over them on the drawing. Let me show you. I'll select the Dimension option, zoom in on the upper left image, and click and drag a box over the outer diameter dimension. Note that I'm including the diameter symbol and keeping the box tight around the value so that it only recognizes these characters. When I release my mouse, you can see an entry was added to the table manager and that it captured the information in the drawing. If the information is extracted incorrectly, I can always double-click the value in any column and manually adjust it. I'll delete this value. In addition to the table manager, you can also use these tools to capture information for project properties. I can select the Properties tab on the left side to show different properties I'd like to gather information on, and pin it to keep it open. While I could manually input values into each field, an alternative approach is to selecting the lightning bolt icon, which activates embedded text extraction. From there, I can click and drag a box over the drawing characteristic I'd like to capture. For the part name, I'll zoom in on the title block by using the Zoom to Area tool from the View tab of the ribbon. Click the lightning bolt icon in the Property Manager. Click and drag a box over the label in the description box. And when I release the mouse button, the name is captured in the field. The same result occurs when I apply text extraction to the part number in the title block. You can see in these examples that both the OCR and embedded text extraction tools are highly accurate. This is because I'm using a searchable PDF file that was created digitally, making it high quality and easy for OCR. However, if I were to use a document of lower quality, the OCR tools could run into issues, and embedded text extraction may be unavailable. To demonstrate this, I'll switch over to a document consisting of a scanned drawing. Notice here in the Property Manager that the lightning bolt icon has been replaced with a camera icon. This indicates that the PDF does not have searchable text and will require use of OCR tools in place of embedded text extraction. Let me show you. For the document number, I'll click and drag a box in the title block over the drawing number. And notice how the OCR failed to capture the information correctly. If you encounter problems like this, the next best step is to adjust the OCR settings by launching the Options dialog from the Home tab on the ribbon and navigating to OCR under Project Options. Here you can find OCR dictionaries for dimensions and notes as well as image filtering settings. The Dimensions OCR dictionary contains several standard font types that OCR compares against to recognize characters and you can even train your OCR dictionary to better recognize characteristics. If one type is causing problems, try switching it to another. For instance, I'll change this to ACAD, click OK, and when I repeat the step, you can see how this change improved the result.